what a wonderful week it's been. Hello, happy Saturday, guys. Welcome to Talk O'Clock. So uh, this week has been very productive for me because uh, I found myself with a lot of free time. Um, free time in the sense of, okay, I didn't have to take care of anything else because uh, it so happens that uh, Jan's outpatient program started and he's doing really good with it. And that makes him leave the house and be away and have, well, I'm me having free time from 8 to almost 5 p.m. So 8 a.m. to almost 5 p.m. Which uh, in turn means... I am able to work at a lot of stuff uninterrupted without like having to think about other things because everything's taken care of, I don't have to help with anything and I have not expected for it to be this way and um, I just decided for myself, okay, for the, years, for the weeks that he's on the outpatient program, I'm just gonna enjoy that time, get stuff done that is not only sitting on my desk for a while now, but um, also uh, pre-produce things for when the weeks come that I don't feel as good or where I have so much going on that I struggle with um, filming or energy or anything. So um, I started the week of, now I have to look at my footage here and I'm not wearing glasses because they, um, they, there's a weird mirroring going on. Uh, by the way, words, mm -hmm. it's one of those days again. It happens to be Friday very often, but it wasn't only Friday. Um, I've been struggling with words this week anyways. Uh, so I uh, started, I think it was Saturday from the shirt. It looks like Saturday. Um, I did film Art Day and it has been published meanwhile. And uh, it's something that I didn't do for a while. Very intuitive painting, um, very mixed media, stylistic kind of a painting. But I made it. I did it. And uh, you can watch Art Day to see the whole shebang. And then the whole week I've been doing uh, my coloring for the 30 day coloring challenge. I'm not gonna split them throughout the days here, uh, but just all in one go. So this is how far I got.
And then remember I just said a minute ago I had so much free time uh, to do things. So I was pretty much done with work every day at like 2 or 3 p.m. And then I could take care of household and uh, run errands, do laundry, yada, 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 a lot of cooking and such. And then in the evenings, because you are was quite tired, um, especially Tuesday evening, it was the first day and he was really, really tired after that, exhausted. And we didn't play uh, any board games. We did that Monday night. But uh, I found myself with even more free time and I kind of wanted to color some more, but uh, not with colored pencils. So I went with uh, a different kind of a book. Uh, I took the um, Mouse Guard uh, coloring book and uh, Inktense pencils and just had some podcasts and interviews, uh, watching them, listening to them while coloring and coloring. And also coloring, because coloring. And I finished the Fox Monday, no, not Monday, uh, Wednesday morning-ish. And uh, then after uh, doing some uh, post-production and stuff, I started cooking. I uh, made a moussaka and it was very lovely because um, I had Jörn for dinner and Sebastian. So he came over on Wednesday and we uh, just enjoyed the evening uh, having some tweaking done on my character for DSA so that I'm able to play Saturday, which is tomorrow. Like, yay, it's Friday today. So uh, we did that and uh, had a lovely evening together and I did cook a lovely moussaka. It takes quite a while to get that done, like three hours, almost four. But I, I just enjoyed it. Again, podcasts with me and just uh, cooking and no rushing and you know, I, I really like cooking, so yay. <music>
Thursday, I'm losing my shoe. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, on Thursday, I started very early in the morning with uh, filming Beyond the Lines, um, getting some artwork done, so you can see that video next Thursday. And after uh, filming was around lunchtime, the weather was so nice over here that for the first time this year, I uh, sat down uh, outside on my patio, just put my legs up, uh, took a good book. I'm reading the second book in the series that Sebastian gave me. Um, just finished the last, uh, the first book, mm, I think late last week. So. Um, started the second book just sitting there for half an hour 45 minutes enjoying the sun and um i kept the audio um file that's the word and listened to all the birds uh tweeting <laughs> it sounds so weird since twitter but uh tweeting away it was oh, lovely and i enjoyed it so much and I can't wait for more spring days to come and me just sitting outside for lunchtime and uh, relaxing after filming and um, getting through the books and also by the way haha I wore a lot of orange on um, Thursday because it's MS Awareness Month so orange necklace orange tights just being fancy and stylish and all of that so yeah that was my lunchtime yesterday. <laughs> And after that and some more post-production, I started making dinner um, and uh, had a lovely dessert, just some, um, what's it called actually? It's not sour cream, but it's quite close with uh, some um, maple syrup, honey and freshly cut uh, strawberries. And it was so yummy and a tiny little bit of 100% dark chocolate sugar-free awesome yumminess for dessert but uh, yeah I made um, lovely dinner a very slow cooked goulash and some red cabbage and potatoes just very um, 
rusty kind of a dinner, but it was lovely. And again, Sebastian and Jan joined me for dinner. And yesterday we played, so Sebastian and I played um, Spring Meadow by Uwe Rosenberg. It's one of the uh, Tetris-like games. Um, it's the third in in a row that he has produced and it's published by Stronghold Games, where I bought it last year at uh, Essen. And we just played a couple of rounds and um, yeah, lovely. Uh, there, there has to be a uh, board game island for the game. I have to put that on the list of all the games that I have to have on the show. I just really enjoyed myself and um, this morning I started out with, uh, while doing the 30 day coloring challenge, you've uh, seen that at the beginning of the vid video, video, that's how you say it, and the rest of the day I just, uh, well, did post-production on the vlog, did all the editing, yada 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 yada, and uh, now it's getting close to the time of Jan coming home, so we got to figure out if we uh, want to do food shopping first or just read, uh, eat leftovers for dinner and then go food shopping, depending on how we want to do it. This is how the rest of my day will be. And uh, tomorrow I'm uh, at Sebastian's grandparents' house for another round of DSA, so we meet up pretty early in the day. So sometime in the afternoon. So we got a lot, a lot of hours to um, uh, spend playing and I'm gonna take my freshly uh, put together character. I do have, oh, I do have my character sheet in here. Da, da, da. She is done. She, her, and again, I, we tweaked her a little bit, like I said, but she's still, um, Leoline, that's still her name. I wanted to keep it because I really like the name and I'm curious um, how the Game Master will have her join the group. So that's gonna be awesome. And uh, then for the weekend, it's gonna be um, role playing tomorrow with the fam. And uh, on Sunday, we uh, will meet up with a couple of friends and start planning our shared vacation for this year. So we didn't do any, we didn't 
plan anything yet, so we're just in the brainstorming phase. But we want to get a little further, um, so we're going to meet up on Sunday, have a lovely uh, early afternoon, I think, together, and uh, just brainstorm for the vacation, what we want to do. So that has been my week, very productive, very artwork heavy, and <clears throat> I found that what I could accomplish in a week, now I could accomplish in two days. So I'm uh, I'm going to keep doing that uh, for the next weeks to come, um, depending on my energy, of course. Uh, but I'm trying to really get ahead and uh, get some filming done and some planning done, some artwork done, because I do have a couple of, excuse me, a couple of projects in mind. There's also some uh commissions coming up so i gotta yeah i gotta get going and also i want to enjoy springtime oh yeah i forgot wednesday evening we were at the movies too so that was a lot of fun as well so at university they do have kind of like a film club and uh, for a very reasonable price you can see recent movies and we watched Zombieland 2. I think that came out like four months ago, I guess, I think. Not sure. But we enjoyed ourselves with a friend group and it was just a lovely week. And I'm looking forward to the next one being the same way. I hope you had a great week, guys. Um, I hope you're doing good. Mental health is awesome. Energy levels are great. You're looking forward to spring weather or maybe spring weather is already happening where you are and uh, I'm gonna see you next week on this channel. Take care guys. Bye!